While the world watched and waited, Taiwan took action. In December 2019, as word of a dangerous new disease from Wuhan, China emerged, everyone from the Taiwanese government to innovators and business leaders in multiple fields to everyday people worked together to protect themselves and each other. Without shelter-in-place orders, without extended school or business closures, and without neglecting a world in peril. Uh, in, in Taiwan, what we're uh, saying is that the government should be accountable to people. Mm -hmm. The government should be transparent to people. But mm -hmm. we're not asking the people to be transparent to the government. Mm -hmm. The CECC have resisted a lot of requests to publish the travel history of mm -hmm. confirmed cases. Oh. Uh, and because of that, uh, people are more willing mm -hmm. to just take some medical mask and mm -hmm. go to a local clinic when they develop a symptom, knowing that because of our healthcare system, it's a single payer system, they will not run into any social or financial uh, pressure uh, when they they um, basically report their contact history for the past 14 days. And this is uh, essential. If we um, make people feel unsafe to, mm -hmm. to report themselves to a local clinic, mm -hmm. then the contact tracers will miss the window uh, mm -hmm. to do the contact tracing. Mm -hmm. So I, th I would argue that uh, it's people's willingness mm -hmm. to trust each other Mm -hmm. uh, and people's willingness to trust the health insurance system and also using the health insurance system to do a lot of creative things, for example, the mask map thing mm -hmm. that uh, people develop is a grassroots thing that mm -hmm. uh, allows uh, everybody to see how many masks uh, are there in stock in each pharmacies and which pharmacies are queuing a lot, which pharmacies doesn't queue that much and mm -hmm. so on. And all these are developed by civic technologists, that is mm -hmm. to say people who work out in the open uh, instead of a, a, as a contractor or something. Yeah, first of all, um, I think technology is mm -hmm. not just digital technology. Mm -hmm. So I must still say that SOAP is the most important technology. Yeah. <laughs> Everything builds on top of mm -hmm. SOAP. Yeah. Uh, and of course, um, SOAP uh, prevents a lot of transmission vectors, mm -hmm. but it doesn't prevent your uh, cell from your own hands. Mm -hmm. So that's where mask becomes useful. Mm -hmm. okay. um, and so in Taiwan, we build masks as something that protects the wearer's health mm -hmm. by protecting me from my own hands. Mm -hmm. And also by reminding me that mm -hmm. uh, I need to wash my hands thoroughly mm -hmm. uh, with this uh, kind of uh, lyric, um, or something mm -hmm. that everybody memorizes that how to wash your hands properly. Mm -hmm. um, and then it's also a social signal so that I can uh, tell other people, oh, you should take care of yourself more, uh, mm -hmm. wear a mask to protect you mm -hmm. from yourself. Uh, and that makes this kind of mask wearing easier to spread mm -hmm. than uh, you should wear a mask to protect me. That's harder to convince people. Oh, okay. uh, and so because of that, I think on top of soap and mask, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. then comes other digital technologies that make mm -hmm. sure that people use soaps and masks uh, correctly and responsibly. But these two, and social distancing, or nowadays we call it physical distancing, are mm -hmm. also necessary. So currently in the world today, we mm -hmm. still have cities like Los Angeles, New York, San Francisco, who are still experiencing um, high rates of mortality. Do you think that the Taiwan model is able mm -hmm. to help places like mm -hmm. this? Yeah, um, mm -hmm. we dedicated a lot of masks and by we, mm -hmm. uh, we, we mean Taiwanese citizens. Mm -hmm. If you go to Taiwan can help that us, mm -hmm. you can check out more than 5 million medical masks mm -hmm. uh, coming from I think 700,000 people now. But for all the medical masks that we're, we donate and for all the masks we produce or help you to co-produce, uh, mm -hmm. it doesn't work unless people wash their hands properly with soap mm -hmm. or alcohol sprays mm -hmm. and it doesn't work unless people are willing to put on those masks. Mm -hmm. And so I think uh, the most important thing, as I said, um, is that uh, the creative messaging mm -hmm. around mask use mm -hmm. so that people see it not as something like a duty that mm -hmm. they have to fulfill to their mm -hmm. neighbors, but mm -hmm. rather something that just reminds themselves to not touch their mouth with unwashed hands. Mm -hmm. And if you can get that message through, I think mm -hmm. it will save a lot of people. Mm -hmm. Well, thanks so much for taking the time today. Really appreciate it. And I think I got the answers that I came to look for. So thank you so much, Audrey. Really appreciate it. Great questions. Mm -hmm. Thank you.